Hi, everybody. Welcome to After the Checkered Flag here on SupercrossLive.com. Ralph Shane and Ricky Carmichael in a rain-soaked Angel Stadium. Boy, when they dropped the gate here, Dean Wilson, the privateer, he took off. What an awesome story. I mean, that guy is here out of a sprinter van, and he's beaten guys that teams spend millions of dollars to have the best bike out there. Unbelievable story. He was literally selling t-shirts and hoodies on the internet earlier in the week to raise money. He's going to sell out of them now. Oh, absolutely. This guy's going to be on fire. I mean, he's going to be the hottest dude in the paddock next weekend in Glendale. Well, when the checkered flag did fall, it wasn't really a surprise that Justin Barsha took the win. I think it was more of a surprise that how long it just took him to get to the lead. Yeah, he it, it took him a while, but I was really impressed with his poise and his race craft. He took his time. He knew he had time, and he really hasn't done that in a long time, so I was happy for him. One other big surprise came in the 250 West opening round, and Colt Nichols led from the start. Great ride from Colt Nichols. He looked really comfortable on his bike. I don't even think that he felt pressured throughout the night. His, result, his results spoke for themselves. Well, we got out of get out of here because yeah. it's it's actually raining yeah. in our booth here. We got to make our way over to Phoenix, Arizona. You'll see all of our action live starting at 9 p.m. Eastern time on NBCSN from Phoenix. We'll see you next week.